So, welcome to another video. So like I said, I'm going to be trying to do this as often as I can. And today, I'm going to talk about kind of the need for a change of perspective. Because in life, you, you go through loads of failures. We go through a lot of different challenges and things like that. Um, and it's very, very important to kind of turn that around um, into something positive. There's this quote by um, Napoleon. I actually have it up on my wall here. Napoleon Hill says, Every adversity, failure, and heartache carries with it the seed of an equivalent or greater benefit. So that basically means that every kind of challenge or failure or even heartache that we face brings with it the seed of something great. So that's something that will benefit us. And that's it's actually quite important to point out that it's a seed of something that will be great. And it's something that we kind of have to change our mindset towards. I kind of say, okay, this is, this is potentially something that could be greater than the failure and kind of water it and kind of work work on on that part um, of, of us that we need to improve. And so in the midst of you know COVID-19 and so forth, we, we kind of have to like okay look around and say, okay, which part of our life can we improve? Me myself, pretend, like I can say that I've used this time to develop a morning routine. Um to, you know, I woke up early, you know, brushed my teeth as you do, I went for a run, and I came back, showered, and then prayed. Um, and then started working. And with that, I've been able to kind of, you know, develop develop a part of myself that, you know, I didn't have before. And I've been making more plans of things I can be doing now. I mean, it's not just for like both improve myself, but it's also just to keep myself active. So I don't start like thinking things I'm not supposed to be thinking or just like, you know, just put myself in a positive place. And again, like I said before, you know, it's, it's a great time to develop ourselves, get closer to God, you know, like specifically, you know, throughout the day, I'm not saying like, you know, pray all the time, but schedule times during the day, throughout the day. So, you know, if, you, if you're working, you have time that you're working and out of that, it's like five, 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, however long, you know, you can't pray or, or read the word of God. Just just take that time, read the word of God. Or even if it's not reading the word of God, watch like a message or something. I mean, I'm not saying like, you know, don't enjoy yourself, but out of that, out of that, you know, 24 hours, it'll be like an hour, two hours. Maybe I'll watch a movie, two movies at maximum. And then I will also, you know, spend time with God in the, in the word of God. Um, and also, obviously, I'm working as well. So it's just like trying to pack as much things into your day that will keep you active, that will keep you, you know, focused. And, you know, I, I would also, I wouldn't recommend, you know, watching the news 24, 24 7. That's just like, like a direct... <laughs> blow to yourself in terms of negativity in terms of, that's that's a perfect way to get yourself into a negative pit hole so what i what i do right now is i would you know when i when i start working i'll just put the news on for like five ten minutes just watch just get a bit of an update of what's going on you know in the wide world beyond in my, my room um and then i'll just shut it off like okay i know what's up and then tomorrow i'll check again just to see that you know if the if the, if the lockdown if you know if everything has been lifted or if there's more restrictions on us ability to go out and stuff like that so the, the goal is not to get yourself in in the hole and i think it's, in, it's even beyond this whole um covid19 thing it's like i think it's a life it should be like a lifestyle whereby we try to focus on the positivity at least that's my, my that's my goal anyways try to focus on the positivity the, the positive side of the world because honestly there's a lot of bad things going on like in everything there's always a good and a bad and unless you decide which you focus on Thank you for watching. This has been another, you know, video from being in isolation. Hope you guys enjoyed this. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. Have a good one. Bye.